Have you ever wondered what the most dangerous skin diseases are? Skin, the largest organ of our body, plays an essential role in protecting us from external threats. Despite its resilience, it is not invincible. In fact, there are numerous diseases that can significantly impact the health of our skin and by extension, our overall well-being. These skin diseases can be deceptive, often appearing less harmful than they truly are. But don't be fooled. Some can be potentially life-threatening causing severe complications if left untreated. From common conditions like eczema and psoriasis to rare and deadly ones like necrotizing fasciitis and Stevens-Johnson syndrome, skin diseases come in a wide array of forms and severities. Understanding them is the first step towards prevention and effective treatment. In this video, we are going to count down the top 10 most dangerous skin diseases, starting from the least dangerous to the most. Coming in at number 10, we have eczema. Eczema, also known as atopic dermatitis, is a chronic skin condition characterized by itchy, inflamed, sometimes peeling or cracked skin. It's not just a simple rash but a complex condition that can vary greatly from person to person, often flaring up in response to triggers like stress, allergens, or irritants. The symptoms of eczema can range from mild dryness and itching to severe inflammation, swelling, and intense itchiness leading to skin breakdown. It can affect any part of the body, but it's most commonly found on the hands, inner elbows, knees, and face. So why is eczema considered dangerous? Well, while it may not be life-threatening, severe cases can cause significant physical discomfort and emotional distress. The constant itchiness can lead to sleep deprivation, affecting overall health. Plus, broken skin from scratching can lead to infections, further complicating the condition. Though eczema is common, it can significantly impact a person's quality of life. Next on our list, at number 9, is psoriasis. Psoriasis is a chronic autoimmune condition that causes the rapid buildup of skin cells. This buildup results in scaling on the skin's surface, often appearing as red patches covered with thick, silvery scales. It's not just a surface-level issue, though. The inflammation and redness around the scales is due to an overactive immune system attacking healthy skin cells as if they were harmful substances. Now you may wonder, what makes psoriasis dangerous? Well, aside from the physical discomfort and potential self-esteem issues due to its visible nature, psoriasis is associated with a range of other health risks. These include psoriatic arthritis, which can cause joint damage and cardiovascular problems. Moreover, the psychological burden of living with a highly visible chronic skin condition can also lead to mental health issues like depression and anxiety. So remember, psoriasis is not just a skin issue, it's a systemic disease that can lead to other health complications. At number 8, we have shingles. Now, while the name might evoke images of roof tiles, shingles is actually a disease caused by the varicella zoster virus, the same culprit behind chickenpox. If you've had chickenpox, that virus is still in your body, lying dormant in nerve tissue. Under certain conditions, it can reactivate as shingles. So, what does shingles look like? Imagine a painful rash that often wraps around either the left or right side of your body, sometimes resembling a stripe. This rash can turn into blisters that scab over in 7 to 10 days and clear up within 2 to 4 weeks. But why is shingles dangerous? It's not just about the pain. For some, the pain continues long after the rash has cleared, a condition known as post-herpetic neuralgia. In rare cases, shingles can also cause pneumonia, hearing problems, blindness, brain inflammation, or even death. Shingles can be incredibly painful and may lead to long-term complications if not treated. Moving on to number 7, it's cellulitis. A common yet potentially severe skin infection, cellulitis is caused by bacteria, most often streptococcus and staphylococcus. It occurs when bacteria enter through a break in the skin, causing an area of skin to become red, swollen and tender. You might experience symptoms like warmth, tenderness, and swelling in the affected area, along with fever and chills. It's crucial to note that cellulitis can spread rapidly, leading to a condition known as sepsis, a life-threatening infection that can cause organ failure. Therefore, it's important to seek medical attention at the earliest sign of cellulitis. With timely intervention and antibiotics, most people recover fully. However, if left untreated, this skin condition can become a serious threat to your health. Cellulitis is a bacterial infection that can become life-threatening if not treated promptly. Now at number 6, we have melanoma. Melanoma is not just another skin disease, it's a serious type of skin cancer. It starts in the skin's pigment-producing cells, known as melanocytes. When these cells become damaged and start to grow uncontrollably, 
they can form a melanoma. Symptoms of melanoma vary, but it often appears as a new, unusual growth or a change in an existing mole. These growths may have irregular borders, varying colors, and they may grow, bleed, or change in appearance over time. Why is melanoma so dangerous, you ask? Well, it's because of its ability to spread. If not detected early, melanoma has a notorious reputation for spreading quickly to other parts of the body, making it difficult to treat and potentially life-threatening. That's why it's so important to regularly check your skin for any changes and to seek medical advice if you notice anything unusual. Remember, melanoma is the deadliest type of skin cancer and its early detection is crucial. Halfway through our list at number 5 is necrotizing fasciitis. This is not your everyday skin disease. Necrotizing fasciitis is a severe bacterial infection that spreads rapidly and destroys the body's soft tissue. The symptoms can start as something as simple as a minor cut or scrape that then becomes red and swollen. The real danger lies in its ability to escalate quickly. Within hours, the infected area can start to feel unusually warm, followed by severe pain that seems out of proportion to the skin's appearance. High fever, fatigue, and vomiting might also kick in. The skin may become discolored, with a purple or red rash that later turns black. Without timely medical intervention, this disease can become life-threatening. The bacteria can enter the bloodstream leading to septic shock. It's crucial to seek immediate medical attention at the first sign of symptoms. Also known as the flesh-eating disease, necrotizing fasciitis is a rare but extremely dangerous skin disease. Coming in at number 4 we have Stevens-Johnson syndrome. This is no ordinary skin condition folks. Stevens-Johnson syndrome or SJS is a rare serious disorder of the skin and mucous membranes. It usually starts with flu-like symptoms followed by a painful red or purplish rash that spreads and blisters, eventually leading to the top layer of the skin dying and shedding off. Symptoms are not just skin deep. They can include fever, sore mouth and throat, and fatigue. The danger level? Well it's significant. SJS is often triggered by a medication or an infection, and it requires immediate medical attention. If left untreated, it can lead to severe complications like damage to the internal organs, permanent skin damage or even death. So, this isn't just a case of bad skin day. This is a potentially life-threatening condition. Stevens-Johnson syndrome is a severe reaction that affects the skin and mucous membranes. It can be life-threatening. At number 3, we have toxic epidermal necrolysis. This condition, also known as 10, is a rare but extremely severe skin disorder. It's characterized by widespread blistering and peeling of the skin, often resembling severe burns. The cause? Usually it's a reaction to certain medications. Now you might be wondering what makes 10 so dangerous? Well as the skin peels away it leaves the body exposed and vulnerable to infections. This can lead to life-threatening complications such as sepsis, a severe and potentially fatal body-wide response to infection. Moreover, 10 can also cause damage to the mucous membranes, affecting the eyes, mouth, and even internal organs. The severity of these symptoms can lead to long-term complications including vision problems and lung damage. This is why it's so critical to seek medical attention at the first signs of 10. Early intervention can significantly improve the outcome. Toxic epidermal necrolysis is a severe skin reaction usually triggered by medication and it can be fatal. Just missing out on the top spot at number 2, is staphylococcal scalded skin syndrome. Now this is a severe skin condition caused by a certain type of bacteria called Staphylococcus aureus. This bacteria produces toxins that can cause the outer layers of the skin to blister and peel off, much like a severe burn. Early signs of the disease might include fever and a red tender rash that eventually begins to peel or blister. It's a sight that can be quite unsettling. The danger lies in the fact that this condition leaves the body susceptible to secondary infections, dehydration, and in severe cases, can lead to sepsis, which is a life-threatening response to infection. The good news is, with prompt recognition and treatment, most people recover well. However, it's crucial to seek medical attention immediately if you suspect staphylococcal scalded skin syndrome. This skin disease primarily affects children and can be life-threatening. And finally at number 1, the most dangerous skin disease is necrotizing skin infections. A necrotizing skin infection is a severe type of infection that causes the skin, tissues and underlying muscles to die. This disease is as terrifying as it sounds. It starts off subtly, often mistaken for a simple bug bite or minor injury, but it rapidly escalates causing intense pain, fever, and skin discoloration. 
What makes necrotizing skin infections the most dangerous is their rapid progression and high mortality rate. They can spread across the body in a matter of hours, leading to serious complications such as sepsis and organ failure. The body's immune system struggles to fight off the bacteria, often requiring aggressive treatments like surgery and potent antibiotics to stop the infection. Understanding this disease underscores the importance of early detection and immediate medical attention. Necrotizing skin infections are extremely severe and can be fatal if not treated immediately. So there you have it, the top 10 most dangerous skin diseases. From eczema's chronic itchiness to the life-threatening Stevens-Johnson syndrome, we've journeyed through a multitude of conditions that can affect the skin, the largest organ of our bodies. We've seen how psoriasis can cause discomfort and how shingles can bring about painful rashes. We've looked at the potential severity of melanoma, the most dangerous form of skin cancer, and the terrifying flesh-eating, necrotizing fasciitis. We've also delved into the skin-scalding effects of toxic epidermal necrolysis and staphylococcal scalded skin syndrome. And finally, we've explored the dire consequences of necrotizing skin infections. These conditions underline the critical importance of skin health in our overall well-being. They remind us of the need for regular checks, early detection, and timely treatment. Our skin is our first line of defense against the external world, and taking care of it is not a matter of vanity, but of health and survival. Remember, it's essential to consult a healthcare professional if you're experiencing any unusual skin symptoms. Stay safe and take care of your skin health.